Hello friends, good morning, good afternoon, good evening. So your friend Kaur is back with the review of another college which is called KLE College of Engineering and Technology or KLE CT and it is based out of Chikodi in Belagam district. So some students have requested review for this college. That's why I'm making this. So this KLE College uh, of Engineering and Technology KLE CT was started in 2008 and it is located in Chikodi area of Belagam and it is uh, you know 16 acre campus which is uh, located on the foot of the hillocks in the Belagam district and it is uh, uh, affiliated to VTU which is Vishwishwaraya Technological University and there are good number of colleges from Kelly group right so I have reviewed already MS Shagiri or Kelly Technological University as well as Kelly IT so this review is only for Kelly CET which is Kelly College of Engineering and Technology from intake intake perspective, uh, a computer science branch is uh, 120 seats and EC is 60 seats. These two branches are quite good and you can definitely take these two branches. Mechanical 120 seats and civil uh, 60 seats. So uh, from the capacity per perspective, it is not a very huge uh, seats in a college, but it is a decent uh, you know college with a good infrastructure in 16 acres and uh, placement also is very good, which I am going to cover next part of it. So these are some of the college pictures and. Uh, it's a quite decent college and placement was also a good number of companies are visiting as well as recruiting students. So these are some of the pictures of CSC, you know, electronics, mechanical department, right, of the college. And these are all good modern buildings and there are good number of audio visual rooms, you know, for the purpose of, you know, academic excellence. So those are all part of good and there is good number of initiatives across, uh, across, you know, women entrepreneurship or, you know, other IT uh, related services uh, you know are part of this uh, college these are some of the pictures of their lab infrastructure and these are some of the playground and the play sports activities basically and they do have a uh, you know a modern campus with the uh, facilities for bus and they do have a coffee cafe day and other cafes into the campus for the students uh, require needs and uh, they are also equipped with uh, boys hostel as well as girls hostel so boys hostel is having 100 rooms and uh, it can accommodate up to 250 students so students who are not from the same city they can basically uh, take through uh, you know this uh, you know boys hostel and a lot of facilities are also part of the so you have you know wi-fi enabled hostels gym facilities indoor games audiovisual you know and vegetarian foods as well and ROP purifiers and all those medium, minimum medical facilities and CCTV camera etc part of uh, hostel facilities and this is the picture of the girls hostel so that is also in a modern and uh, from the girls hostel perspective there are two separate girls hostel one for the senior guys one for the junior girls for senior girls this is a, in a three floor building as you have seen in the uh, previous uh, you know, sheet and uh, it provides for facilities with cots and similarly for the junior girls it's uh, also considered a three floor building with 54 rooms and can accommodate up to uh, 162 students so quite good with respect to hostel facilities and these are some of the girls hostels you know uh, facilities which are available including gym and uh, you know coffee vending machine and the other wi-fi uh, which are the minimum infrastructure uh, some more here in, in the same campus you get the general stores you know with for your cosmetics and other needs and mess uh, with canteen and both for vegetarian feeds and then there are beauty parlors also into the campus for the other needs and furniture in the room infrastructure photos are also there now coming to the most important plan part which is the placement part of it so as you see this doesn't have a good uh, large number of seats but 202 students of this college have been selected in the last year which is very good compared to the number of seats in this college have so i'm just also showing you know the companies where students got so cap gemini have recruited eight students from this college which is good tcs 21 students and Wipro 11 students and SCL Technologies 10 students. So you see good number of you know, big source IT companies like this are taking students from the college and which is a quite uh, good you know because all of these four companies are good Capgemini, TCS, Wipro and also SCL and Infosys are also part of the campus recruitment. 
now if you have to see the branch wise placement so out of those 202 students right computer science has 120 students out of which 115 got placed so that is almost like a 95 percent placement which is very good ec as 60 students out of which you know 49 got placed so almost like a 80 70 75 to 80 percent and mechanical has a 28 student uh, 120 students but only 28 got placed and civil also 60 students only 10 got placed so mechanical and civil you can avoid in this college but cse and ec you can definitely take and this is one other one of another snapshot of the students who got placed mostly from the computer science ec students who were got placed in tcs with a salary of uh, 3.5 lakhs so this college is basically for those students who are you know getting at the lower ranks and they want to take college in their own region so this is a good option the placement for cse and ec is good you can get 100 percent placement and job in bangalore thanks for watching and please do like and subscribe this channel and to get more views